cellular response to stress cells actively interact with the environment constantly adjusting their temp- uh, structure functions to accommodate changing demands and extracellular stress so bas- basically what is the stress pressure or any kind of tension exerted on a material object stress can be of two types tolerable tolerable by the cells tissues organs or harmful stress tolerable stress for example increased heart load yeah or nutrient supply decreased nutrient supply harmful stress uh, can be caused by the cell damage decreased oxygen supply such as hypoxia and uh, ischemia trauma toxins as this is example of a cell under stress the cell undergo adaptation achieving a new steady state preserving viability functions if the adaptive capability is exerted or if the external stress is inherently harmful or excessive cell develops cell injury cell injury is of two types reversible irreversible when certain limits injury is reversible the cells return to their stable baseline However if the stress is severe persistent and rapid in onset it results in irreversible injury and the death of the affected cell Irrevers- irreversible cell injury leads to the cell death necrosis and apop- apoptosis necrosis is a premature death of the cells due to the external factors apoptosis is a programmed cell death adaptations uh, taken by the cell when cell adopt to injury their adaptive changes can be atrophy hypertrophy hyperplasia metatrophy cell death is also normal and essential process during embryo embryogenesis so during the growth of the baby most cells are are mostly cells undergo death So that's the end of the topic. I will meet you in my next video. Till then, goodbye.